Happy Wednesday, guys. Happy 39 weeks of pregnancy. To me, Jackson is not here yet, clearly. And I feel as large as a truck. It like really hit me today that I just feel huge. It could be a lot worse. I could feel a lot more uncomfortable. At this point, I'm just very eager to meet him, and so that's why I want things to get going. Uh, I feel like I have a longer update for you guys because of yesterday's doctor's appointment. Nothing's bad. Jackson's fine. Just Let's start with Monday night. I was about to fall asleep and then I kind of psyched myself out and was like, Jackson didn't seem like he was moving as much today. What's going on? And I probably should have been doing kick counts up until this point, but I haven't. So I had my doctor's appointment yesterday. So I went in at 8.50. Matt couldn't come with me in the morning. So I went in and I just mentioned, you know what, I feel like he's not moving as much as he usually does. And they said, let's do an ultrasound just to check if everything's okay. Everything was fine, his heartbeat was great, he was moving, he was even practicing his breathing. I could see his little diaphragm moving, which was really cool. So after the ultrasound, I saw the nurse practitioner and did the usual thing. Do you have any questions? Yada, yada, yada. And then she measured my stomach to see like an estimate of how many weeks or whatever he is, you know? So she took the measuring tape and said, you're measuring at 33 weeks. And I was like, what are you talking about? I was starting to worry and I just got freaked out. And she said he most likely dropped, but just to be sure, she wanted me to come back for another ultrasound that afternoon to do measurements. So thankfully, I had it open and Matt could go with me to that other ultrasound. So I went back at 12.50 with Matt and they did the measurements on the ultrasound and everything was fine. He's perfectly fine, on track. I was really happy that they could get me in that afternoon instead of like the next day because I would worry all day. But she also checked if I was dilated or anything. Still no, cervix is soft. No dilation, but she also said that, you know, it doesn't really say anything. I could leave and go into labor. Some people are dilated for like weeks and nothing happens. So I'm not really like too concerned about the whole dilation or cervix thing. So that is the update. And now we can see how big he is today. 39 weeks. He is the size of a small watermelon. Finally something cool. 20 inches, 7.3 pounds. How cute. And I keep seeing this and I'm like, no, he hasn't been born yet. But I can't wait to say, yes, he is born. And today was my last day training at the gym. I'm officially on maternity leave. So I'm excited. It's gonna be nice to just focus on working from home and waiting for Jackson to get here. And when he's here, spending time with him until I feel like I'm ready to go back and train at the gym again. So. I'm excited. I trimmed my nails yesterday just because they were getting kind of long and I put on like this really cute color combo. So I want to show you guys what I used for my nails. I used OPI's tiramisu for two and then on top I used the Formula X color in Starfish on top. And then on top I used the Sally Hansen Miracle Gel Top Coat, which makes them very shiny. And I just got this, so I don't know how long it really makes your nail color last, but hopefully it's a while. The dogs got a bath today, so they are relaxing and staying warm. Hi, Munchkin. I don't know where Nugget is. Probably hiding in Matt's clothes. And this is where I've been a lot of the time is on this ball bouncing and then I play N64 while I bounce. So this is the bump update today. It is definitely the size of a watermelon, if not two watermelons. <laughs> Whew. My family and I and Matt all went to get some junky Mexican food last night. So I've got some tamales, a mini chimmy, a little rolled taco, leftovers. Trying to get things moving. 
Oh, and for anyone wondering, this is the raspberry leaf tea that I've been drinking. I got it at Sprouts, but I think it's at any grocery store. So it's just the raspberry leaf caffeine-free herbal tea. And I actually really like the taste of it. I've read a lot of people don't. I'm almost out. But I have about a cup a day. Very, very tasty. My mom was down to go get a pedicure, so that is what we are going to do. <laughs> so we had a bit of a change of plans. I was driving to my mom's and then Matt told me that his sister is in labor and the baby's coming right now, so we're going to the hospital and we're gonna go see her baby girl. That is the update. Are you excited to meet your niece? First one. First niece. We just left the hospital and we met Paisley and she's so cute. I have to show you guys a picture of her. Look at that little face. So cute. Congratulations, Carrie. Are you happy to be an uncle again? This is really cute. I'm gonna make a smoothie with the vanilla protein powder from Orgain some almond milk, maybe some orange juice, and some pineapple. Do you want one, bub? Yeah. Yeah! Matt and I are gonna go take a walk around the neighborhood. We've been doing this nightly. We're back from our walk, and I am going to close out the vlog now, so I'll see you guys in the next video.